Hello, my name is Armando with Plumero in Phoenix. Today we're going to show you how to drain and flush a water heater. Follow me. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to connect the hose to the flush valve. By draining and flushing your tank, we're going to get rid of all the minerals and sediment at the bottom of the tank. I'm going to open the handle. And we're going to let it run for a total of five minutes. And the proof is in the pudding. Let's see what we got. Oh, yucky. All of that buildup. Look at that. And that's why we do water heater flushes. Now that we've drained and flushed the tank, we're going to check the anode rod. On this water heater here, we're going to find the anode rod on the back of the water heater right there. Close the water off to the water heater. So here it is. We're going to be using a inch and 1 16 socket with a DeWalt impact gun. This is puppy over here. Anode ruts is a sacrificial part of the water heater, so I do recommend checking that every year. Let's get this guy out of here. All right, so this is what we have left. This is the metal piece that holds the anode rod together. This is definitely gone. We're gonna definitely be recommending it for replacement. All right, so now that we have the new anode rod here, and this is, I call it a sausage link. And the reason we call it that is because we don't have enough space to put a full anode rod in there. So what we'll do is we'll just feed this into the tank and that should be no problem. And now we're going to do the Teflon tape here. I'm just going to do a little bit of it right here. That should be good. Blue Monster, just to kind of lubricate it a little bit. That should be plenty. Now follow me, let's put this in the tank. We're ready to put this guy in here. Now rod in, let's go ahead and turn the water back on. You're our baby now. Welcome to the family. All right, we've completed the water heater maintenance. We flushed, we drained, and replaced the water heater anorod. And remember, when others are stuck, Plomero and Phoenix is flowing. Ahora en español, cuando los demás se rascan la cabeza, Plomero and Phoenix tiene la solución. Thanks for watching.